stuck to you like glue, baby. Wanna spend it all on you, baby. My room is a cheese pot. Call me Mr. Flinster. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, my friends. Hey, guys, how's it going? It's your boy, Robert the Farmer. I always look like this. Back with another mini... Mondays! Number two. This is our second mini Mondays ever. You know the drill. It's like a Robert IDK video, but shorter. Get your week started off with a kick, with a bang. Best voice crack compilation. Funniest voice cracks. Listen, I'm not gonna torture you guys with a 20 minute video of this, so we're gonna do a mini video of this. I had this idea after the recent video, after this legendary Robert IDK video here. Worst vocal crack ever. I'll take care I had to do a whole video on it because that was too good. It was, it was too good, guys. Voice cracks are some of the greatest entertainment that America has to offer. We're starting with one of the greatest voice cracks of all time here. Ever, I, if you haven't seen this one, you're in for a treat. God bless America, my home. Hit us, baby. Sweet. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Amen. Amen to that. <laughs> Sweet the one note you didn't want to mess up. The one thing we didn't want to happen. <laughs> That's what it sounds like when Robert the farmer spends a bit too much time in the outhouse. <laughs> Taking a bit too long in the outhouse. <laughs> Alright, hit me with some voice cracks I haven't seen before, fam. But I woke up every day. Oh, <laughs> Sean Mendez! Missy! Yes, sir. If you saute scallops in a non-stick pan, they won't stick! That's why it's called non-stick! <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I love me a good voice crack. It's called non-stick! Yo, I, this is why when I when I do a voice crack in a video, I will repeat it and slow it down because voice cracks are way funnier when you slow them down. Just a small town girl. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Living in a lonely world. Oh! It's call me Mr. Flintstone, I can make your bedrock. A, a little inappropriate, you guys. You guys know this is a family-friendly channel. You shouldn't be saying that, but... Call me! Call me! Call me! Uh, uh. <laughs> no way! Yo, he lost his voice. After he messed it up once, the voice was gone, and it left to never return. The voice was like, yo, you are not singing this song in 2020. And it was like, nope, I'm out. My room is a cheese pot. Call me Mr. Flintstone! I think an invisible bat just flew into his throat. A really, a good voice crack, you can't fake that. Like, I, I try. I try to fake a voice crack sometimes, and it just doesn't work. I want to know if the rest of that was real or not. Well, let's see. We're going to get the call here. Oh boy, oh boy. After reviewing the play, the puck was, the whistle was blown dead. The goalie <laughs> was shoved into the net with the puck. That is not a good hockey goal. Wait, is this real? After reviewing the play, the puck was, the whistle was blown dead. Yo, hockey is like one of the toughest sports in the world. You can't come through with that. But yo, okay, this reminds me actually. When they go to review a goal in hockey, if a goal, like they aren't sure if it's like a legal goal or not, they'll review it and then the ref will come out and go over the mic and say if it was a real goal or not. Unfortunately, he had a rough one. After reviewing the play, 
The fuck was, the whistle was blown dead. My worst voice crack of all time, and I still think about it to this day, was during hockey. I was always, I used to play defense, so I was like out back, and I was kind of like a hype man. I would always like be like, yo, go for it, shoot, go, go hard. And there was a time when straight up, just like, I was back, the rest of the team was up there. I was like, go hard! I was trying to say go hard, but it straight up was go hard! <laughs> I'm not kidding you. It was like the highest scream I've ever done in my life. It was loud. Everyone in that rink, everyone in that arena heard me. <laughs> it's truly one of the most embarrassing moments of my life. So if you're going to scream things during a hockey game, make sure you're done puberty, okay? Because <laughs> I, I didn't follow that rule and look what happened. That's probably how I ended up like this. <laughs> the ball comes out! The ball has come out! Yo, why does this, this sounds like a Canadian. It's come out. Comes out. The ball's out. Are you telling me this dude's American? Derek Johnson, the all-time leading tackler in the history of the game. <laughs> what a touchdown. <laughs> Yo, these are the best voice cracks. When it keeps going, it's one thing to have, like, I understand if someone's shouting, like, one thing cracks, but when it keeps going. <laughs> Listen, I feel for these people. I've been, I've been there. I've had this level of embarrassment in my life. We're still calling to love me now. Ooh, now. I was gonna try to do a little yodel over there, and it sounded disgusting. That wasn't that bad, James. Ooh. That wasn't that bad, James. Bro, that was not that bad. Yeah, no, guys, guys, that was, I was just trying to do like a, I was trying to, uh, the reason my voice cracked there, I, just, I was trying there, to do this, this little, uh, yo, it's fine. It's fine, guys. Voices, voices crack. It's okay. I think one of the worst things you can do as a singer is hype yourself up like you're just a awesome singer. Because then, when you do have a voice crack, it's like, yikes. <laughs> you're here. I'm here. Hit me, Brock. Let's do <laughs> yeah, Brock Lesnar. Yo, no matter how tough you are, this is Brock Lesnar, you guys. I don't even think this clip shows you how manly this dude is. Brock Lesnar. This is who we're looking at here. One of the most scariest, most giant mammoth human beings humanity has ever experienced. Voice cracks do not discriminate, you guys. Literally anyone can have a voice crack. Let's do this. <laughs> Before we get underway, let me introduce you to our casting team on the commentator's desk. Oh. <laughs> no! No, I need the rest of that clip! I need the rest of that clip! I want to hear the audience reaction. And before we get underway, let me introduce you to our casting team on the commentator's desk. Oh. <laughs> oh, he did not play it off. Yo, but okay, here's why. Here's why they cut it off. Is this a gaming tournament? I think this is a gaming tournament. And so most of the people in here probably have voice cracked every sentence and they probably didn't even notice. <laughs> They're probably like, what? He was just talking normally. Uh, he was just talking normally, wasn't he? That's probably <laughs> what they're thinking. Casting team on the commentator's disc. Oh. Commentator's disc. This is going to be beautiful. Wow. Oh, oh gosh, oh. That dude's voice crack there is probably his version of my hockey voice crack. If they invent time machines, guys, I promise at 1 million subs, I will go back in time and find that hockey voice crack and record it and bring it back and show you guys at 1 million subs. And that's also implying that time machines are invented, okay? Which they probably will be, so definitely get to the million subs. Toronto! Sean Mendez, they're really doing it to you, bro. They're really doing it to you, Sean. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Sean. It happened to the best of us. It's happened to me. It's even happened to the greats of voice cracks. Okay, Sean? It's okay. You have a beautiful voice otherwise. Listen, we're only halfway done. You guys want me to do this again? This was really fun. I could do this for hours. <laughs> Let me know if you want to see another one, okay? Because this is one of my favorite things in the entire universe. If it was one of your favorite things, hey, this is School Plays Gone Wrong. It's, it's one of my favorite videos. Go check that out if you like this because it's very similar. Or just watch this video. You know, whatever you want. As always, guys, this was Mini Mondays. You get a short video every single Monday. Let me know what you think. I love you guys. Have a good one.